All right, guys, so now we're on the 17th hole at Marriott Worsley, and me and Peter Finch are one down against these rascals at the moment. And we're playing foursomes, so we're giving you some tips on foursomes as well. And we've come now to a short par four. Uh, we've got this and then a par five straight after. So we've got a couple of little choices to make here. We've, we've got the, the safe route, whether these guys are going to go safe or whether we're going to attack it. Also, you can check out everyone's Twitter name somewhere along the bottom, and everyone's YouTube channel, everything else because they're not bad guys, these, to be fair. No, they're, they're awesome. They're great, <laughs> great team. I'm trying to suck them up so they can let us win this whole. Great team at Trafford Golf Centre, so you can check out all their teams, uh, all their Twitter names, the Facebook names, and their YouTube channels as well are in the description, so go and look at all those videos as well with some great advice. So, 17th hole, let's do this. So, it's your honour, gents. We've got a... We've got 284. We've got a drivable par four. If it is drivable. We've got Dan, the cameraman, down there. And I've decided that I'm not big enough. Part of this decision has been made by the fact that we are one up, two to play. Um, I've got confidence in my partner, Andy. If I can leave him 50, 60 yards out, easy par four. It's going to be an easy little knock <laughs> Look at that face. That face of a confident man right there. <laughs> so I've gone two iron, old school two iron. Let's you have a look at it, Pete. A, Let's have a look at the two. want to use a hybrid. Wow. This is a club I've had in my bag for 14 years. It's still got a wooden tee peg in the back end here, which I did as a repair job when I first qualified as a PJ Golf professional. Give us a close-up of that, feet. The tee peg back in there. Oh, uh, yeah. 14 years that's been in there. The Callaway too. Okay. So you reshafted it from a hickory shaft? Yep. <laughs> I don't like this modern fangled hybrid stuff. So we're aimed on the left side of the bunker with the two iron. Someone's put a camera in front of the tee as well, so I'm trying to avoid that. That's a nice golf shot. Awesome. Perfect. Cheers, Little draw just on the left hand side of the fairway. Quality. Position A. Right, well, I've got to go for it. Go like, I've got no other choice, have I really? I've got the I 15. It's 284. And I'm seeing it in a much more positive light. I'm seeing it downwind, easily reachable. Not too much hazards down there. We've got Dan, the cameraman, that I'm going to see if he can catch it. We've got <laughs> Finch, who's giving me all the support in the world to get this on. <laughs> we've got it we've got to do something haven't we really we've got we've got to nail it on there so i'm gonna go straight at it there is a bunker just short of that flag i believe but i'm gonna go i'm gonna carry it let's see if i can do this december the 9th and i'm trying to carry driver 280 odd big lad oh, it's a bit toey wasn't quite perfect no, it's, it's on the edge. front it's edge. edge, it's on the front edge, not quite perfect. I've just caught it a little bit toe side of centre. So it's not in the prime position, but we've got a chance of getting up and down and getting this match back to all square. It's a brave play. That'll do. <laughs> it's a new modern hand, uh, um, fist bump. Quite aggressive with this one. 55 yards, flag's cut right at the front of the green. It's kind of sloping away from the flag as well. So we're going to go in really high with this one, be aggressive. So this, is a, this is a bit of a tricky one, because this is short path, how far have we got, sorry Andy? We've got 55 yards to the flag. 55 yards, and what so are you going I'm with? Gonna go with the, I'm going to go with the lob wedge, but I'm going to open the face a little bit as well. I'm going oh. to be really aggressive with this one, get it coming in from a nice height. Okay, <coughs> Try and land. just in semi-rough, sitting up quite nicely. Sitting up quite nicely. Start. Look how beautiful this day is. This is December, guys, in England, <laughs> Manchester. In England. Candy, show us what you got. Up, up and away. Is it there? Oh, it's there. That's a... Oh, oh. it just stayed on the edge. How's that not rolled down the hill? Span back. Wow. <laughs> so, it's not bad. Level, pin high. Quite happy with that. I've got a nice connection on it. Can't believe it's not rolled down the hill. One little bounce forward. That is honestly And that was close. Harsh. What a shame. <laughs> <laughs> right then, partner. Right, indeed. I've not done too bad. Just on the edge, how far are we? We've not even bothered zapping, have we? About it's not even far, it's like 20, 20 yards, if that. yards if that. The only problem is that big crest just before the pin. And it can... all slopes down from there. Ah, uh, yeah, so can pretty, see it. Pretty precise with where I'm actually trying to land this. But this is where you're awesome, Finch. You know, this is this is your terrain. We've all seen your chipping video. Guys, check out his YouTube channel for his little chipping video. Unbelievable chip of the golf ball. So. Now normally partners are meant to ramp up the pressure. <laughs> that's not pressure, that's encouragement. <laughs> it's 
Stop quickly, stop quickly. Yeah, not too bad. You've got a bit unlucky there. That's released, that's the ridge bad. that we talked about, unfortunately, just kicked off that ridge and it's ran past. How far past? How far? It's uphill, uphill on the way back. 12 feet for birdie. Got to hold it to try and get back into the match. Okay, so birdie opportunities. I think we've just sneaked it a bit closer there, Finch. And I would say a much easier golf shot, much easier put. <laughs> we've got we've got Pete Styles and Andy Carter. Team reading, come on. Only reading. just passed, but downhill quite significantly. We need to hole ours. They don't. They can trickle it down there. We've got one hole left to play after this. You're going downhill. And downhill just... off the right hand side. Yeah. Not much in it though. It's a funny little green. This it tilts very much front to back. So you normally expect a putt to break to the front of the green, but this one. Greens are in great condition this time of year for the Marriott Worsley. So you're just really outside the hole. Yeah, yeah, right lip. Yeah. It's got to trickle it down this hill. Break. Whoa. 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 These are quick. They are, they are quick. These are quick. <laughs> I'll just get my putter. Oh, quick. Andy Carter didn't even have his putter out. I don't like that, that play, Andy Carter. I don't like that play. That puts a lot of pressure on your playing partner. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, so. Just be careful of the spy mark next to it, Simon. <laughs> um, yeah, Pete. <laughs> Mr. Dyson. Right. I don't like that play, Andy. Andy Carter. What? I don't like the play of leaving your playing partner on the green and w walking out without a putter. I had every faith in you. On the playing partner. There was no pressure there. Hey, Just, right, Finch, there. <laughs> uphill. This is, on, this is it. After the put on the last. I don't even need a read. No, we need one. No. This is in. Right, I've got to hold this. It's got to go in to make some drama down the last. <laughs> you don't need to hold it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, he's nailed it. Ready for the birdie. Great right, put. Sorry. Right. Yes. Right, put. So guys, well part two finished. Ricky Shields with his birdie on 17. We're going to take it down 18 now to see who can take it in the foursome challenge with myself and the Trafford Golf team at the Marriott Worsley.